All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. And today I wanna quickly talk about two new gameplay mechanics that we can all expect to get on both Global and JP once the download celebration officially begins at the end of this month. Now, this is something that a lot of people have been talking about for the past couple of days. So it's not exactly breaking news. I'm sure many of you have heard something about it. But the reason I decided to hold off on making a video until now is because I was waiting for more information to come out or more official uh, images to show you guys. But at this point, I'm pretty sure we're not going to be getting anything official or anything new until the download celebration happens or until we get the data download for the download celebration, which is at least two weeks away. So I think now is a good time to talk about it and just quickly discuss it. But before we jump in, I do want to give a big shout out to two members of the Dokkan community, Markinen3, as well as Hydros for all the hard work they put into mining the game and just providing us with all the information that we're going to be using in today's video. So huge shout out to those guys. But as far as the new mechanics go, like I said, there are going to be two of them. The first one is partner specials or partner super attacks. And the second one is conditional super attack effects. So let's start with the partner super attacks first because that's honestly the one that's much more intriguing to me, much more hype, much more exciting to me because it sounds much cooler, right? And it's essentially what the name sounds like. It's very self-explanatory, right? It's two units, you know, combining for a special super attack as opposed to their normal super attacks. So for example, you have a Goku who let's say normally would do a Kamehameha by himself, but let's say if you have a Vegeta on the rotation and they have the ability to perform a partner super attack, then they'll combine and do a special combined partner super attack with Goku and Vegeta, as opposed to just, you know, Goku doing his own thing with the Kamehameha, right? So here's a little visual that Markin and 3 actually put together. And this is just for, you know, demo purposes. It's not gonna look exactly like this. And actually most likely it will look kind of different, but this should give you a good idea of what you know we're talking about right so you got the goku you got the vegeta and once they're you know linked together on the rotation you have that cut in of vegeta coming in saying kekarat and then they combine together to do a partner super attack like that and uh, that's basically the idea behind the new mechanic obviously this is just one example of many many different combinations that would be available in the game i mean there's just so much they could do with this right like you don't have to just do goku and vegeta obviously there's going to be a lot of goku and vegeta combos i'm sure you know base goku and vegeta super saiyan goku and vegeta super saiyan blue goku and vegeta super saiyan god goku and vegeta um ui goku ssbe super saiyan force so on and so forth but you can also have a bunch of other you know less common combos like maybe broly and paragus obviously the androids or even Tien and Shoutsu if you want to, um, Bardock and Goku, Vegeta and Trunks. Um, it doesn't even have to be canon combos really, right? It could be like, you know, Vegito and Gogeta, for example. It could make it happen. And I would assume partner super attacks or combo attacks are gonna be more powerful than just the regular super attack that a unit would have performed. But uh, I can't confirm or deny that because at this point, we don't really have much information about the effects. Um, it's really just theoretical at this point, I guess. So uh, I do want to put a disclaimer out there actually that none of this is official. All right, this is all just very early information and we will have to wait until the official data download or some kind of official announcement from Bandai to know exactly how this stuff works. But we can definitely speculate. We can definitely you know, talk about it, have a conversation about it, right? And it's definitely something that I'm excited for, man. It's uh, actually something that probably should have been in the game a long time ago, right? Like it just seems so obvious as far as the mechanic goes, having like different units combining for combo attacks, but uh, I'm glad it's finally being implemented in the game. I'm excited for the potential. And actually, if you guys want, let me know in the comments down below what a, you know, hype combo for you would be, you know, what kind of partner super attack would you like to see as far as the characters go or the actual attack goes okay so that's the first thing that is the um partner super attacks or partner specials mechanic 
And the other one, like I said, is called Conditional Super Attack Effects. And I think the name is also pretty self-explanatory, but uh, essentially it's a effect that is triggered um, for a unit super attack when certain conditions are met, right? So one example would be an HP restriction for a unit where if the uh, team has like a certain amount of HP, let's say below 80% HP or below 50% HP, then the super attack will guarantee stun or maybe guarantee seal or something else, right? And obviously HP is just one example of a restriction. It could be a restriction for a certain unit on your team or a restriction for a specific kind of enemy or maybe even a specific event. I mean, the possibilities are kind of endless at this point until we have more information about exactly how everything works. Like I said, it's very, very early and uh, I can't tell you guys too much as far as the details go, right? But I guess some obvious examples could be like, if you have a certain unit on the team, then your super will guaranteed stun, or if you have a certain kind of enemy, then you'll do an additional super attack, or if you have a certain amount of HP remaining, then maybe your super attack will attack all, as opposed to attacking just one enemy, or something like that. I don't know, I'm just brainstorming at this point, but uh, yeah, that's kind of the idea. The conditional super attack effect would be a super attack effect that occurs when you meet some kind of condition, right? And I know it kind of sounds like just a regular passive. You're like, how is this different from just like the current passive effects? But I'm assuming that this would be completely separate from a unit's regular passive, and it would be an additional effect that's triggered when you meet some kind of condition, all right? So there you go, guys. Conditional super attack effects, partner super attack effects. They're both very interesting to me, but the partner super attacks is definitely much more exciting just so much more potential in my opinion and uh, i can't wait to see the combos that we get of course i think when it first starts we're probably only going to have a few combos maybe it's only going to be goku and vegeta and some of the obvious ones like goku and vegeta maybe the androids uh vegeta and trunks and that might be it but uh, we'll see we'll see what happens because there is definitely a ton of combos that could do there's a ton of potential with the system and uh I'm just hyped, man. I was already excited. I was already excited for the download celebration, but with this stuff coming out, and also recently, I've just been re-watching the Boo Saga to refresh my memory. I'm getting really, really hyped for this download celebration, guys. All right, so um, stay tuned for more information. We've only got about three weeks to go anyways before the celebration begins, so not too much longer to wait. But uh, that's all the information I have for you guys today. That is going to be today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know in the comments down below once again what kind of combos and what kind of attacks you would like to see from this partner super attack mechanic. And as always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you'll like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, Hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.